Hello everyone, Ryan Hicks here with another short tutorial showing you how to get the most out of Positron. By the end of this video, you'll know how manual chapter creation works and the two most common ways that people use it. To understand what I'll be talking about, you don't have to already know anything about Positron. However, this tutorial is only covering the specifics of manual chapter creation. If you'd like to know more about how to use the proofing tool or other Positron features, check out our other tutorials available on YouTube or visit our main support page. If you'd like to test manual chapter creation out on your end, all you need is a Positron account so that you can log in to create a project, some material that you can cut and paste text out of, and a recording to match it. I'm gonna step you through the exact process in the next minute or so. If you don't have any credit minutes in your Positron account, we'll gladly provide you with some if you'd like to do a test run. Almost every time you'd typically use Positron, you upload a script and that script becomes the anchor of a project. Any audio you upload will attach itself to that script. With manual chapter creation, the process is a little different. Instead of having a script, you'll have something that you can copy and paste into the script input area, and then you upload audio that specifically matches to that, and only that, text. There are at least two times you might use this functionality. One time is when you don't have a script at all, or don't want to use a script file, and the second time might be when a chapter in a book has been modified or updated, and you want to check narration against the new version. I'll show you both of these so you understand what I mean. Let's look at a blank project with no script. I'm going to create a project, but not import a script. On the next screen, I'll manually create a chapter, then add my text, upload my audio, get my results. Note that Positron's other features like the pronunciation guide, character guide, and scan occurrences don't work with manually created chapters. Now let's look at adding a manual chapter to a book in progress. Let's say that chapter one here has been modified quite a bit. For example, sentences have been reorganized, some material was taken out, and other material was added. Normally, I'd have to make a whole new project with a new script to use the proofing tool. However, by creating a manual chapter and re-uploading the new text and then the matched audio, I can keep everything synced in a single session. Again, keep in mind that this new text won't show up in the other Positron features. Thanks for watching this short presentation, and if you have any suggestions about manual chapter creation or anything else you'd like to see in future software updates, let us know by emailing hello at positron.com. We're here to help you get the best tools for your best stories.